Hey, what's up guys? Welcome back once again. It is me, Molt. So happy to be here with you guys as always. And uh, as you can see, we are on our Clash Without Walls account collecting a whole bunch of loot because of the boosts that we have uh, going on. How long is this going to take? Six hours to upgrade those? We're not going to mess with those right now. Um, what level are these? Five and six? These are, do I have any other fives? I got some sevens. Um, why don't we go ahead and so we have two builders. Um, first we're going to start off with a bang and we are going to research our wizards. All right. So we've got a lot of loot right now. We're going to just start off researching the wizards. They're going to be done in two days and that's going to be awesome. Let's see, uh, what kind of, so we're going to get 20 more damage per second with that. 18 more hit points. That's awesome. The next upgrade up to level four, I believe. Um, or wait, are we, I think we're going up to level four right now. <laughs> no, we're going up to level three right now. Either up to level four or level five is the big one where you get just ridiculous damage increase. Um, so I'm definitely excited for that once we get there. We are upgrading our elixir storage right now because we need more. We've just been getting so much. And right now, if you guys aren't taking advantage of farming, you need to because this is the one time a year where farming is at its best because people go to sleep and uh, their minds are just boosted and they're making a lot they're making you a lot of loot so uh, that's why I was a little bit worried that I was gonna get a lot stolen last night but thankfully I had a shield until about an hour ago but I haven't even been attacked since then so um, that was definitely lucky. But what we're going to do is, I guess we're going to start off with an attack, and we also need to see what we can upgrade. I know I can upgrade my... No, I can't upgrade, I can't upgrade any of my cannons. Uh, I can upgrade my air defense. I can upgrade my clan castle. I'm not really going to upgrade the clan castle, um, just because I don't use it too much uh, at this point on this account. Um, let's go ahead and just remove these as well. Um, and so I think what we're going to do, so our mortars, our wizards, and let's see, level 7, level 7, level 7. What can, what can I even freaking upgrade? I think I only have elixir upgrades left. Um, so everything that I have to research in here, um, wizards, balloons, both of the spells is all that I have left. Um, and then the gold storages. And the elixir storage is, I guess I could upgrade this other elixir storage. Um, can I upgrade this one more time? No. Okay, so after we do that, then we're going to be set on the storages. And then I just have to upgrade the mines and pumps, which is going to take forever. Uh, normally, you have so much to do with gold because you have all the walls to upgrade. But I guess that I don't. So um, why don't we just go ahead, go on the attack. Let's see what kind of bases we can find. Because I know that there are going to be some good ones. Like even that one you saw that um, the guy was boosting his mines and pumps. So that's all you really have to look for on this is if they're boosting their mines and pumps or not. This guy is not, but he's got a whole lot of loot. Um, let's just take this because this is all pretty much free loot. We're not even going to have to deploy everything. So we're going to drop off some goblins to help us out. Um, Barbarians is a shield up here. A couple of goblins to help get that for us. And then we're going to get all of this loot. Uh, from this guy. Let's see if we can. Uh, I wouldn't mind getting 50% on this though. Um, 16 trophies. I am eventually going to be pushing. Guys, let me know how y'all feel about this. So we have this account right now where we're just playing on it and seeing what happens. Um, <clears throat> and it's fun. I actually enjoy it. Why did they skip that cannon? Um, so I actually enjoy this. It's a lot of fun for me. Um, we can go ahead and end the battle right there. This is a lot of fun for me, but I want to make sure that it's interesting for you guys. So let me know if y'all want me to do like a wall list. Uh, I think I'm pretty sure I can get to crystal right now. Um, I know that if I spend a lot of time just town hall sniping that I can get up to champions because there are people up there. Um, but that would take a lot, a lot of time. And it might not be that interesting for you guys to just see town hall snipes. Um, so let me know if you guys would like to see like uh, crystal without walls. Um, Anything like that, and we can just make it a little bit more interesting for y'all. Uh, right now, it's a lot of fun, and we're we're moving along. Um, <clears throat> I am in Wipeout right now, which is the sister clan to eliminate. Um, this guy's a champ. Look at him, killing it. He's got a gym box up there. He's got to get. Um, so let me know what y'all think about that. I think I might do like crystal, try and get to crystal one, 
uh, maybe on here, but a lot of it is just going to be town hall sniping um, and stuff like that. So uh, we'll have to see how that goes and if you guys like it or not. Um, but why don't we go ahead and up, we'll upgrade the air defense. So that's going to take three days. So we'll do that one gold upgrade. And then I know I can do my bombs, but ugh, I just don't, I'm not going to upgrade those for a little bit because with what, blah, blah, blah. Without having walls, my bombs pretty much get deployed every single time. So if somebody attacks me, um, and how, how much is it to refill? I, I can't see, oh, here we go, info. So the rearm cost on that is 12,000 gold, okay? The rearm cost on these are 2,000. So 2, 4, 6, 8, and 12,000, that's 20,000. And then all these little bombs, every time somebody attacks, if I only have 20,000 gold available, but they deploy, but they get rid of all my bombs, then I've actually lost a lot because I have to rearm them. So you have to be careful with your bombs and whatnot. I'll probably upgrade them eventually as I get more buildings and stuff, um, but I'm not going to do that right now because I don't want to lose that much gold from it. <clears throat> um, why don't we go ahead and upgrade our um, elixir storage as well, unless there's something else that we, I feel like I have to be missing something. <laughs> so we have all the cannons. I don't think I can build anything. I mean, I can build decorations. I'm not going to do that. I can't build anything in the army. Uh, can't build any defenses can't build any more resources so that's all so I can't build anything else we're gonna have to go up uh, to a new town hall soon so that we can get more stuff to build um, oh and we'll get the barbarian king at town hall 7 so that'll be great um, but I guess can I make can I upgrade that no I can't upgrade that either so uh, let's go back on how many troops do we have Ugh, we only have 63 that sucks um, let's see what we can find with 60 <laughs> with, the, blah, 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 with 63 troops. I'm all over the place today. It's ridiculous. So let's see what we can find with 63 troops. I bet we can find something like that last one where we only used about 60 troops um, to get all the loot. Like, we could get all that right there. Um, but I want to I wanna find a base that's boosted and the guy hasn't woken up yet. Or the girl, whoever it may be. Um, this one has a pretty good amount of gold on it. I guess we could... Let's, let's attack this one. Uh, one, two... Uh, some of his gold mines are inside the walls, or at least one of them is. Let's keep looking, because those aren't even boosted. We're going to find one that is boosted, and we are going to take a good amount of his loot that he thought he would wake up to. Here we go. All right, so this one's awesome. Um, go ahead and drop off some barbarians, some archers, a couple of goblins just to work in there. Uh, a couple of goblins right down here as well. And then barbarians and archers down here. And then we're gonna wait for them to get rid of those. Uh, we're gonna wait for them to get rid of those gold mines, uh, <laughs> to get rid of the gold mines, to get rid of the army camps, and then we're gonna come in with the goblins. Um, so now they are focused on the archers. So the goblins should be able to get in there and do work. But that cannon is shooting my goblins. <clears throat> so we are going to drop. Let's drop a lightning spell right here. Let's see how much gold we get for this. So it's at eighty-eight. Ugh, we didn't get that much at all. We only got 8,000 gold for that. Um, but I bet we can get a good amount of elixir from dropping one right here. Yeah, so we got uh, almost 10,000 from that. But I think that's how much the spells are. So that wasn't that good. But again, that was only with 63 troops. So um, if we add up both of those, let's add up both of those attacks. That's 89,000 and 100 and whatever. That's not a bad, that's not a bad raid down here. Uh, so I'm definitely fine with that. And I guess that's going to be it. Well, no, we have to... Let's go ahead and just upgrade this other elixir storage. Um, so we are... Gosh, we did a lot in this video. We're researching the wizards. We are upgrading an air defense. And we're upgrading an elixir storage as well. So that's awesome. Definitely be stoked about this account, guys. Leave a like down below if you're enjoying this. And also, let me know if you want to see uh, Crystal Without Walls. And then once we get there, hey, who knows, maybe we'll go up to Masters and uh, so on and so forth after that. But thank you so much for watching, guys. I really do appreciate y'all's support. I mean that. You guys rock. You know that. Um, and hey, as always, make sure you keep calm and clash on for me, right? I'll see you guys later.